Ladies and gentlemen, can I please have your attention? I've just been handed an urgent and horrifying news story. And I need all of you to stop what you're doing and listen. Also known as the Panda Photographer, and this is my Tamron story. I chose the Tamron SP 90mm micro lens for the A mount, which is model F017A, for this optical performance, its autofocus capabilities, its sharpness, its bokeh, its build quality, and not only that, its weather seal. For the Sony A mount system, I find myself very intrigued which lenses work the best for this A-mount system. I typically use Nikon and Sony, but right now I'm using Sony and I love the image quality that comes out of this micro lens. This 10 mount lens features 14 elements, 11 groups, and 1 LD low dispirit and 2 XLD extra low dispirit glass elements. I find myself really intrigued about the e-banding that's also applied to the lens. But not only that, this core sustain is a B-bar, which is called Broad Banded Anti-Reflection. It kind of is a dramatic improvement on the anti-reflection effects that delivers flawless, crystal clear images every single time, especially against the sunlight. My intentions and reasons on purchasing this lens was to actually apply it to my A-mount system from Sony, but to also test it out in the real world as a street photographer. But keep in mind, street photography also can apply as micro photography. There's many subjects and many objects you can actually micro size and get great image quality from. Keep in mind that the Tamron SP90mm from for the A mount system, it's a very good choice if you do have or own an A mount system from Sony. As a love interest in micro photography, I found the micro world to be so lovely and so beautiful. And I hope you, as the photographer and viewer, understand that the world is a beautiful place and the micro lenses that Tamron produces bring that beauty to life. Mm -hmm.